So I think one of the problems uh, so far with this format, aside from my own, you know, lack of talent, is I'm not doing anything on purpose, and I should really be doing something on purpose. But anyway, I'm going to start with some goofy old glasses, just because that's as good a starting point as any. I'm looking at a picture of John Oliver on my computer, so I'm using a little bit of him in it. It's nice to have something to look at for inspiration, even if it's just anything, you know? There's a picture of John Oliver open on your computer where you can see it and you need to draw something. Which is, why are you in that situation? You put yourself there. I put myself here. I put myself into a position where I needed to do this. To film my own drawings and talk while I do them and desperately draw something, even at times when I got no ideas. And my ideas are talk about why I draw while I draw. I went to art school. I did painting and printmaking. I didn't actually finish. I was one class away, and, uh, Oh no, my computer monitor turned off, so I lost my picture of John Oliver. It's back. Um, so anyway, I didn't actually finish because there was this class, and I'm being like, a little honest here. Like, I'd be dismayed if a prospective employer heard this story, because I don't look like the smartest dude in the world for this story. But I want to just be honest about what happened. I didn't want to take this class really badly. It's called University 200. It's meant to be like a super easy sophomore English class, which is a terrible sell. It's like, why would I feel any kind of accomplishment for getting like the easiest class that the university can offer done? It makes me lose all my work ethic. And I know that's whiny baby shit. You shouldn't, you know, like demand to always have absolutely the best tasks available to you at all times, or else you're not going to do any work at all. So you have to make your own work if you want to do the things you want to do. And that's why I have to do this. That's why I have to draw for the camera. One last thing I have to do is turn it bad. Turn it ugly. Turn it into something crass.